Man, that's a lot of destruction on the field. Oh, it was loading. Well, that's not good, is it? Come on. Come on. Stay with me. We're almost there. Almost there. Almost there. It's not much further. Don't stop. Don't. Come on. <clears throat> Cormac! Makes you think, would this actually be cheaper if they made... If they got the actual actors to like, put gear on and like, act this bit out? So what now? Now we finish this thing. We're the only ones who can stop our hands from launching Manticore. It's three of us. Against an army. It's suicide. You're right. But it's what he would have done. Is someone gonna fix my arm? Okay. You got any ideas? Just one. He's got like weird numbers tattooed on his face. He's one of those guys. Is he? He's either a super badass or a super dumbass. Terminus. Exotype AST. Okay, so I'm not getting my arm back. It was a plan only Gideon could have come up with. A frontal assault on Iron Stronghold using the two mech suits we found back at the base. Drones would fly us in. After that, we'd be on our Two own. mech suits. Sentinel 2-1. detecting high levels of contamination in the city. We will not be able to get ground forces to assist you. Over. Copy that, Kingpin. Enemy forces are closing on your position. I see them. Firestorms. the water? Rachel, detach. Oh Jesus. He's getting the living shit out of me. We're subsurface, approaching the breach point. 2-1, be advised. We will be forced to strike the command center if you are unable to stop the launch. We'll risk further manticore contamination, but it will be our only option. If you don't think you can stop it, get the hell out of there. Copy that. Okay, where are we going? I am still missing a left arm. Oh, they're shooting at us. This is very, very slow. Breach point is up ahead. Let's move. Gideon! Thermal readings are spiking inside the command center. They're going to launch soon. That's we'll make it. probably not good, is it? Gideon, where are you? Okay, there you go. I have to move my mouse so many times just to get this to turn. This is the full range of my mouse. Mitchell, like, me. Left to right, that's it. Underwater, underwater things makes me nervy. 
I don't like it. Man, what was this place? Why is it why is it flooded? Why are there stairs? Ilona, we're inside. You should be right next to the launch pad. Security breach in the cyber. All units converge on sector four immediately. That's not good. That's us. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'll give myself motion sickness. Unauthorized personnel in sector four. Repeat. Unauthorized personnel in sector four. Contact! One of those ready. Double ready. Then go ready. Yes. I'll probably do like another run through of this game just to get all the intel. Ready. Don't get in there. Where are we going, boss? Launch in B minus four minutes. Swarm missiles ready. You say go down, right? Cargo loading in progress. Swarm missiles ready. Rabbit ready. Boss, where are we going? Ready. Yo, boss. Where are we going? Swarm missiles ready. Gideon. Launch in T minus two minutes. Gideon. Stage three boosters check complete. Is it because we finished this so quickly? Maybe because we Got finished. It. Keep we, pushing forward. Maybe because we did this so quickly that. Yes, yes. We did this so quickly that uh, they, they had to be, uh, get the two minute timer down. There's the hatch. Mitchell, over here. I'm here, I'm here. Keep closed. Launch 
in T minus one minute. F. F. Stop the launch. I'm gonna get you out of here. Stay with me. Okay. Put me in view of people. Future soldier. Gotta keep moving. Stay with me. Ah. Dude, I can walk. Sentinel 2-1. City defenses are breaking. Atlas troops are collapsing. We need to know the status of that launch. Copy that, Kingpin. The launch has been aborted. Repeat, launch is aborted. You copy. Kingpin, come in. Shit. Ilona, are you receiving? Damn it. Cut off. We need to move. They're gonna hit this building any minute. Then move faster. I'm setting you down. I need you to try and walk, Mitchell. I find some light. will do my best. Oh. Hi there. Hello, Mitchell. Don't you fucking move. I could ask the same of you. He's hacking into our exo. Come out of ammo! You rely too much on those things. The city is falling. It's over. What I have started won't end with me. It's bigger than me, and it's certainly bigger than you. You think I'm a monster? That's yes. only because you don't have the conviction to do what's necessary. Necessary? The attack on America. Unleashing Manticore, killing thousands of innocent people. I'm saving the world from itself. When there's no one left to challenge Atlas, there will be no more wars. There had to be sacrifices along the way. Yeah. Twisted fucks throughout history have used the same argument. I don't know who stopped the launch. They'll bring this entire building down on top of you. I could have killed you in the prison camp. I could kill you now. But I won't. I'm not a monster.
Yeah. Mitchell, try to hit the release on your exo. F. Yeah. Release. Now mine. It's not working. There's no time. If he gets away, this will all have been for nothing. Go. Now! Oh. Don't let Irons get away! I, I did say it was missing a cool slide, right? Now we got a cool slide. E. Off we go. Throw the knife, Mitchell. Mitchell, hey. pull me up. I'm not letting go, so you got to pull me up. Mitchell. There's only two choices. You either pull me up, or this whole building goes down and we go down with it. You cut my arm off. Mitchell! What are you doing? What are you doing? Mitchell! I gave you that arm. Mitchell! I gave you a second chance. Good. I didn't need that arm anyway. I've got okay. you, mate. I've got you. There's only gonna end one way for it. Irons gave me a second chance. And I gave it back. He thought he could solve the world's problems. If he did have the answer, he took it with him to the grave. He was right about one thing. This wasn't the end. It was just the beginning. Ah. So I'm missing an arm now. Probably for the rest of my life. Do not roll credits. At least give me something. Mm. So what, it just ends with like, Irons dying and that's it? I, I feel like that's very... What's the word I'm looking for? Not satisfying. That, I guess that's the closest I can, I can get to it. I really hope that there's something after the credits. Uh, the story itself was good. The plot twist that Irons was a, you know, power-hungry warmonger really, really was a, was a, a, you could have seen it coming. But, yeah. No, nothing, can, um, not a lot can be said about uh, the, the game except that it's a Call of Duty game, it plays like one, except it's got cool future tech, so that was nice, I guess, it's a, <laughs> never soft, it's, um, it's a definite uh, change from the normal games I would say that overall this is like this is one of the best stories I've played 
if you're looking for like future future soldier because if you're looking for a more realistic thing you obviously go for modern warfare but this is all right Mitchell was a very vanilla guy the, the character I ne didn't think I'd end up liking was um, was Gideon Gideon was really cool uh, Ilona didn't have enough screen time and I thought that the Hades subplot thing was um, wasn't as wasn't as uh, wasn't as captivating as it could have been because it's like oh look at this big big terrorist and then that was it led by Kevin Spacey as Jonathan Irons with all these look there it is Gideon Emery is the guy that plays Gideon how cool is that and there's good old Troy just below Steve Bloom Troy Baker also also part of the additional cast Uh, I felt that the cinematic speaking of cinematic there's a lot of people uh, speaking of cinematics I always thought that this could always this could have been a live action thing like shoot it in live action for most of the most of the uh cutscenes company 3 has a man called T-Bone yeah so just shoot it in live action I'm, I'm pretty sure it's more expensive to like get a CG scene out for every mission maybe it's not maybe I'm I, maybe I don't know what I'm talking about but I would have done it with uh, live action because live action's cool Other than that, summary, the game had, the game was fun, pacing was alright, lasted about two hours, maybe a bit more. Huh. No, that, it didn't last two hours, obviously, it was about four hours, 15 missions though. So that was that was something. I feel like I need to go look at all these um, all these um, all these actors now. Like. They obviously lend their real faces to it, so... Yeah, it's a... It's a decent enough game. Controls very well. Ran, ran at 60 apart from all, that, all those crashes. So... Yeah. Fingers crossed there's a... Uh, it's a thing at the end of end of the end of the credits. Because if there isn't, I'd be a little bit disappointed. <laughs>